Welcome to First Word Farmers News Roundup for June the 28th, brought to you today by Senior Editor Matt Dennis. In our top news story, Pfizer will invest around $350 million in a biotechnology centre in Hangzhou, China. The company noted that the plant will ensure the local production of high-quality, affordable biosimilar medicines. Also in the news, Novartis entered an agreement with Zencor, potentially worth more than $2.5 billion, for the development of bi-specific antibodies for treating cancer. The deal includes a $150 million upfront payment to Zencor, with the company also eligible for over $2.4 billion in milestones. In other news, the European Commission approved AstraZeneca's Zavi Sefta for the treatment of serious gram-negative bacterial infections requiring hospitalisation. The combination antibiotic, previously known as Kazavi, is being jointly developed with Allergan. In addition, Teva and Allergan agreed to sell a portfolio of US generic products to Maine Pharma for $652 million in cash. The divestiture of the products was required by the US Federal Trade Commission in connection with Teva's proposed acquisition of Allergan's generic drug business. And finally... The FDA placed a clinical hold on studies of Regulus Therapeutics RG101 for the treatment of chronic hepatitis C. The agency took the action following the report of a second serious adverse event of jaundice in a patient in an ongoing phase 1 study of the therapy. To read these and other stories in full, visit firstwordpharma.com. Are you able to keep up with all the news and views in the biosimilars market? First Word's Biosimilar Index is the only dedicated biosimilar and non-comparable biologics intelligence tool available. Get ahead of your competition and learn more today.